Okay, so here I have a plushie of Quaxley. And as you can see, his hair is all messed up and he has a frown on his face. So what is the story behind this? Why does he look like this? And yeah, what's up with it? Well, sit down, I'm gonna explain. So right now, if you go to the Pokemon centers in Japan, and I'm talking about like right now, like spring to summer of 2024. If you go to the Pokemon centers in Japan, you'll notice that Quaxley is like the main mascot, the main event, and you'll see that they are advertising him everywhere. I mean, we do know that Quaxley is one of the main mascots of Pokemon right now. Pokemon Scarlet and Violet are the mainstream games right now. So Quaxley being one of the starters, it makes sense for him to be one of the mascots. And you'll notice the employees are wearing like a Quaxley hat and like a Quaxley shirt. And they're saying something in Japanese, but if you don't know any Japanese, you're not gonna understand what they're saying and you're not gonna understand what the event is about. So I'm gonna try my best to explain that, you know, just by like being there and visiting the Pokemon centers. And pretty much what they're saying is, is hey everybody, we have lost Quaxley. Quaxley is in trouble. Can you help us find him? And can you help us get him out of trouble? Now, if you notice when you're at the Pokemon centers during this time, you'll see that there's a bunch of Quaxley products and Quaxley plushies like all over the place. And you also notice like on the walls, there's like Quaxley like decals or like stickers on the walls. So I mean, he's everywhere, all right? Like he's not that hard to find. So pretty much all you have to do to participate in this event is go up to one of the employees and tell them that you found Quaxley. That's all you have to say is like, hey, I found Quaxley. Now you have to say it in Japanese because you know, they're not gonna understand that Quaxley, that's his English name, and they're probably not gonna understand any English. So you're going to say it in Japanese. So Quaxley's Japanese name is Kuasu, and to say I found him is Mitsuketa or Mitsukemashita if you wanna be fancy about it. So all you have to do is go up to one of the employees and be like, sumimasen, Kuasu Mitsukemashita, or simply, Kuasu Mitsuketa. So when you do that, you know, the employees are gonna be like, oh, congratulations, you found him. And it doesn't matter, like, you know, you could point at one of the plushies, grab a plushie and be like, look, I found him. Or point at one of the stickers, or it doesn't really matter what you point at, just be like, yo, I found him, there he is. And when you do that, they're gonna give you a sticker. And the sticker, the sticker is gonna look like this. So pretty much it's Quaxly with like his hair all messed up. You know, he's looking sad, similar to the plushie. You know, they're exactly the same. His hair is messed up and he's looking sad. So they're gonna give you the sticker right here where his hair is all messed up and he's looking sad. At this point of the event, they're gonna tell you, all right, the next step is to find the Quaxley that is in trouble and you need to help him get him out of trouble, all right? After you get your first sticker, you're gonna go to like this QR code. There should be a QR code somewhere in the Pokemon Center. You're gonna go up to that QR code and it's gonna pretty much tell you like, hey, this is how you're gonna get started to helping the, the Quaxly that is in trouble, all right? So you're gonna go up to the QR code, you're gonna scan it, it's gonna open up a web page that's gonna be kind of like a camera with like a little magnifying glass, you know, like a little search glass. And yeah, from there, you're gonna have to find the Quaxly that is in trouble. Now this is gonna be kind of hard depending on the Pokemon Center you're at. The one I was at, it was pretty easy because you know, if you go to like the corner of the Pokemon Center, you'll see like this little monument, like this little statue of like a bush and you'll see like Quaxley's like feet sticking out of the bush. But in some of the Pokemon Centers, it's a little bit more difficult to find. But pretty much, you scan the QR code, you the camera pops up, open on your phone and it tells you to start searching for Quaxley, the one that's in trouble. Now the Quaxley that's in trouble is like that little statue, that little monument where his feet are sticking out. It's kind of weird to find, but it's somewhere in the Pokemon Center. You gotta find it somewhere in the Pokemon Center. It's kind of hidden. I don't think it's that hard to find. I mean, it's meant for kids to find, so it's pretty easy to find. Once you have the camera open, you go to that monument or that little statue with his feet sticking out. You point the camera at his feet and you kind of, you know, get kind of close to it, kind of back away from it. It kind of just, um, you'll see like on the icon, wait for it until it reacts. You know, you'll be pointing the camera on it. You'll see his little feet. Look at your phone. And once you get the correct angle, on your phone his little feet are gonna like he's gonna pop out of the bush in real life it's a bush with his feet sticking out on your phone you're gonna see the bush but his feet is gonna start to wiggle it's super cute man it's really really cute but anyway his feet starts to wiggle and then he pops out and when he pops out you'll see on your phone he's gonna pop out he's gonna look at you and his hair is gonna be all messed up and in Japanese letters like it's kind of like if you don't read Japanese it's kind of hard to understand but pretty much you have to help him fix his hair you gotta fix his hair you know so all you gotta do is like rub his little hair 
head, you know, just rub his little hair. His hair starts to get like all soapy, you know, you keep like rubbing your finger on top of his hair and eventually it fixes itself, you know, it fixes. His hair isn't messy anymore. His hairdo is back to normal. He has a big smile on his face and he's happy. And you know, your phone, it pops up with the screen saying, congratulations, you helped Quaxley get out of trouble. You helped him fix his hair and now he's happy again. Cool, huh? So after that, you take your phone, you go back up to one of the Pokemon Center employees, you show them your phone and it shows them like, hey, I helped find Quaxley, I helped him get out of trouble and I helped him fix his hair and now he's happy. And the Pokemon Center employee is gonna reward you with, boom, another sticker. And in this sticker, he's happy with his hair due, all fixed and he looks like a normal Quaxley. And this sticker is kind of like holographic, it's kind of shiny. So that's your reward for like helping Quaxley. It's a sticker. So pretty much that's the event, man. That's pretty much what the event is about. It's just getting a bunch of stickers, a bunch of free stickers. You go up to a Pokemon Center employee, be like, hey, I helped find Quaxley. He's right here. Here's a sticker. He's looking sad. Step two, go to the QR code, find the little monument or the little statue with your camera. He's gonna pop out, fix his hair, and boom, you get another sticker. And that's what the event is about. So anyway, after participating in the event and you know, like getting the Quaxley stickers and helping find Quaxley and fixing his hair and doing all of that, man, I thought it was super adorable. I thought the event was adorable. I thought it was cute. And after doing all that, of course, I decided I had to buy this plushie, man. I had to buy this plushie of him with his messed up hair and his little sad face, man. This plushie is super adorable. It's super cute. And right now at the Pokemon Centers in Japan, they are selling a bunch of products surrounding Quaxley and his messed up hair, you know, like, like right here. You know, you could get like a bath mat, you know, like toothbrush. There's many, many products of Quaxley right now. And I think just like, I don't know, like I really enjoy this look of his. I mean, his original look, his original look with like his like clean hair and his little hat hair or whatever, it's fine. But this look of his right here with his messed up hair, I think it's super cute. Like I prefer this look over the other one. This is my favorite version of Quaxley there is currently. And yeah, I just had to pick up this plushie, participated in the event. And yeah, that's pretty much it, man. You know, it's just a small, cute event, you know, meant for kids, but anybody could participate. But yeah, I mean, that's pretty much all I wanted to do was just hop on here, kind of explain to you guys what's going on when you do visit the Pokemon Centers in Japan. So if you do go to the Pokemon Center in Japan, or if you are in Japan right now, you know, participate, go up to an employee and just participate, you know, get your free stickers, buy yourself a plushie and, you know, just uh, get involved, you know. I think it's pretty fun. I think it's cute. And yeah, if you guys found this video entertaining and somewhat helpful, you know, drop a comment, drop a like. And if you didn't like the video, you know, of course, drop a dislike. But yeah, thanks for watching and I'll talk to you guys in the next one, right? Peace out. Mwah, mwah, mwah.